Sometimes, rather than finding the sum or average of values in a range of cells, you'll just want to know how many cells in that range contain a number, any value at all, or are blank. Excel has several functions that count the number of cells in a range that contain a particular type of data. All these functions are versions of the count function. The count function counts the number of cells in a range that contain numbers. So let's say that you use a worksheet to track the bottle breakage rates at your warehouse. If you want to count the number of days where you had any sort of breakage, you would want to count the number of cells in this range, B2 through B10, that contain a numerical value. You might put in NA to indicate that you didn't take a measurement that day, and you could also have a blank cell just in case you forgot to enter a value. So the count functions that I'll show you will take care of all of those scenarios. So now let's create a function that just counts the number of cells that contain a numerical value. For that, you type equal, count, and then a left parenthesis. Now all you need to do is type in the range of cells that you want to examine, B2, through B10, right parentheses to close, and you get the number six. So you have one, two, three, four, five, six numerical values, and that corresponds with our answer. Now let's say that you want to count the number of cells that contain any value at all. In other words, all of the cells that are not blank. To do that, you use the count A or count all function. So that's equal count A and then a left parenthesis, and again, the same cell range, B2 through B10. Close it up, hit return, and the answer is eight. And that corresponds with our measurements here. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight cells that contain any value. So those are the six numerical values and the two NA. If you want to count the number of cells that are blank, in other words, the ones that have no values in them, then, as you probably suspect, you can use the count blank function. Left parentheses, B2 through B10. Hit return. The formula returns the value 1, which corresponds with the one blank cell in our list. These three variations on the count function help you discover the number of cells in a given range that contain particular types of values. In larger worksheets, using a count function tells you how much data you have in your collection, which can often be surprisingly valuable information.